The second heat of the men's 800 metres T20. Mark. The intellectual category is Rafa Kork of Poland in three, Jan Magus Versen of Iceland in four, Jacek in five, Kapozlu in six. Both Kork and Jacek, bronze medalists at World Championships and Paralympic Games. And Jacek won silver in the 800 metres in the last European Championships in Grosseto. It's the top three who automatically qualify plus the next two fastest losers. And Sparrison comes into para athletics after a fantastic career, which has been continuing in para swimming. He's a Paralympic European champion in that. All very tightly bunched at the moment. The two poles, Cork and Yasuk. Progressing through on the outside, Rafa Kork, bronze in the 1500 metres of the World Championships in London. And Yatsuk, bronze in the eight there. Poslu of Turkey leading the way as they head towards the bell. Sixth in the 400 metres and ninth in the 800 at the World Championships. Then it's Yatsuk, Sverison is third and Kork is fourth to the bell and Kork has stepped out. Cork has stepped out after 400 metres. He seems to have suffered some sort of an injury. And so these three are going through. And it scarcely matters about the order now. Well, Cork was at the back of that quartet. And right of the bell steps off. He's going through the tunnel below us. There is a grimace on his face, so there is some sort of strain on him. It's Kapozlu who leads for Turkey, Yapsuk in second for Poland, and Jan Marko Sverison of Iceland in third. They are going to go through, and the pace is definitely slackened off. They're all progressing. Well, they could just walk from here, and they'd go through. And Sverison, after years of glory in Paris swimming, probably is a bit of pride to say, well, I'm not going to stroll around. It's his major championship debut in para athletics. He's going to go through. So too will Yatsuk, who takes it. Yatsuk wins. Ferrison second, Kapozlu third. 2.20.71 the winning time. And that really, in the end, was a trot. Sverison pulled away and looked like he was going to take it, but 2.20.71 is almost half a minute outside Yatsuk's lifetime best. Sverison wasn't far behind, and that was about 10 seconds outside his lifetime best. It didn't seem as if Rafa Cork was struggling, and he's been winning major championship medals on the track in this T20 for the last six years since London 2012. That was the final acceleration from Sylvester Yatsuk. And he gets the win in this heat, 220.71, ahead of Sverison. Totally different set of muscles, obviously, and used differently. Had a little dip as well, Sverison. It didn't matter. They all 